Robert, what's going on, young brother? What's going on? Watch this. That image right there, right? Who, who, who is this? Huh? You say God, right? How old are you? Twelve. So we got a twelve-year-old out here saying this white image is God, and that is a problem. That is a problem, young brother. I'm gonna show you the truth according to the Bible because ain't nobody else showing you. We are gonna show you the truth according to the Bible. Revelation chapter one. Do you know about Jesus the Christ? Right? I'm gonna show you what he looks like according to the Bible. I'm gonna show you the truth because it's crazy. It's crazy. We have young black black, black boys and girls. Eight, nine, ten years old can easily point it out as Jesus the Christ. Why? Because it's a problem, young brother. Watch this. Read the book of Revelation, chapter one, verse one. So I'm gonna show you out the Bible what Christ truly looks like. Because that image, that ain't him. That's not him. Even though we've been taught, guess what? I've been taught the same thing. I was born in Jamaica. Growing up, the same thing. I closed my eyes. I was praying to a white man on a cross. And that's a problem, young brother. Read. The revelation of Jesus Christ. The, re re the revelation of Jesus Christ. The, the root word is to reveal. We're about to find some things out about Jesus Christ, in other words. Come down to verse 14. Watch this. Verse 14. His head and his hairs were white like wool. So we read in a description now of Christ. You understand? He said his head and his hairs were white like wool. We got two things right there. We got a color and we got a texture. Christ had white woolly hair. Do you know what wool looks like, bruh? Do you know like sheep's hair? Yeah. Who has that kind of hair? Is, is that man that has that kind of hair? Nah. Who has that kind of hair? Take off the hood, bro. Take off the hood. That That is woolly hair right there, young brother. So what are we reading in the Bible? Read that part again. His head and his hairs were white like wool. So we read in the Jesus Christ and he said his head and his hairs were white like wool so we got strike one on that image because that that's long street here Christ had woolly white woolly hair when you go on Google you know about Google when you go on Google and type in woolly hair it says Negro hair Negro textured hair our hair brother Christ had hair like us so that's strike one on that white image go on as white as snow go on. and his eyes were as a flame of fire. He was just saying his eyes were red, red with wine. All right, go on. And his feet. Now his feet. Remember, we're reading a description of Jesus the Christ. Now the prophet, the, the, the apostle John, he looks down at his feet. Right? He sees his feet now. Now, that's your question. Is your feet the same color as your body? Same color, right? So watch this. Read. And his feet like unto fine brass. John said his feet like unto fine Brass, B R A S S. What does that look like? Color, brass, like brownish color, right? Oh, watch this. Go on. As if they burn in a furnace. So if I take that brass, I put it in fire and I take it out. What is it going to become? I take the brass, I put it in fire, I burn it, I take it out. What does it look like now? Was brown before? Burn it? No, no, what? Huh? No? We burn it, we put it in the fire, we burn it, you take it out, what does it become? But when you burn anything, what does it become? Uh, it, it burns down. Dark, black, 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 brother, black, black. That's right. You understand? Christ is a so called black man from the tribe of Judah, sister. We're bringing out the image of Christ. Christ is a so called black man. If Christ, if Christ was walking the earth today, he looked just like you and me. Hell, these dudes killing each other would try to kill him. Because, again, there's a murderous spirit here in Old Block. And we're bringing out the importance of that because we see each other. Give me 1 John 3 and 15. We see each other and we hate each other. I, I don't see Christ in you. Why? Because we see this man as Jesus the Christ. We see white folks as the people of Christ. We don't see our, ourselves as as the people of Jesus the Christ. What's going on? Now that's good. Let's go. Yeah, take the fire. Take it up. Read it. All right. That's some good information for you, brother. All right, sister. Take the fire. Read it. But I want you to listen up. Christ is a black man. Don't forget that because ain't nobody else will tell you that. You understand? Read that scripture still. The book of First John, chapter three, verse fifteen. Read. Whosoever hated his brother. So the Bible said, whosoever hated his brother, go on. Is a murderer. 
is a what? A murderer! The spirit of hatred is alive and well in O Block. It's alive and well in Chicago. We hate each other. Brothers, you all hate each other. That got to stop. The people that enslave us, the people that oppress us, they're sitting back just watching us kill each other every day. Oppressing each other every day. Read again. Whosoever hated his brother in Whoever hated his brother is a murderer. Is a murderer. Give me Isaiah chapter 59 and verse 7. I'm still addressing the murderous spirit here in O Block. The murderous spirit in Chicago. Because best believe that there is going to come a day of judgment. Oh, you think you're bad now? Wait till Christ return. Y'all think you're bad? Wait till Jesus the Christ returns. Then you're going to see bad. Read. The book of Isaiah chapter 59 verse 7. Their feet run to evil. God said their feet run to evil. Why? Because a lot of y'all glorify this life. A lot of y'all glorify this life. Yeah, 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 yeah. I want, I want to go make some drill music. I want to go do this. I want to go, I want to go make a name for myself in the street. Y'all run to evil is what God said. Read again. Their feet run to evil. God said, my people, your feet run to evil. Brother, I want you to hear the scripture, brother. Read it again. I'm, I'm, I'm addressing the murderous, evil, hateful spirit in O Block. Am I, am I lying when I said that? Am I lying? Is not there a murderous spirit here? Yes, 100%. So I'm addressing that out of the Bible. You understand? God sent us here to edify the people, to warn our people that we need to repent before judgment come, comes on this earth. Read. Their feet run to evil. God said their feet, our people, our feet run to Sisters, our feet run to evil. That's why we're killing each other. That's why we're killing each other. Y'all need to listen. Y'all walking upon down all black every single day. Y'all don't see this often. Y'all should be like, Yo, what the hell's going on here? Let me stop. Let me stop. But the same, same, same thing. God says, you reject me, I will reject you as well. Read. And they make haste to shed innocent blood. God said, my people make haste to shed innocent blood. Y'all, y'all, y'all rush to do this thing. Y'all quick to do this thing. Shed innocent blood. A lot of the blood that's shed in, in, in Chicago, people ain't even doing nothing. People just going home from work, drive by, 20 dead. Murder of spirit. Read. Their thoughts are thoughts of iniquity. God said, you young men, you brothers, your thoughts are thoughts of iniquity. Thoughts of sin. There's no righteousness in our works. There's no thought. There's no thought. If you know what, let me put the guns down today. Let me stop selling drugs. That is not going on in Chicago. Every day we wake up to kill ourselves, kill ourselves, sell drugs to each other, gang bang, and we glorify this life. Read it again. Their thoughts are thoughts of iniquity, wasting and. Destruction are in their path. Read that part again. Wasting and destruction are in their path. God said these type of men, destruction is in their path. Teach. Everywhere y'all go, y'all killing, y'all killing. Y'all quick. Y'all walk down the street, y'all bump up, brother, y'all ready to shoot him. Y'all ready to go, oh, let's go right on this block. Let's go right on these niggas. Destruction is in your path. Your feet is quick to do evil. You brothers, in all black, you need to repent. You sisters, you need to repent. And acknowledge that you are the children of Israel. Read. The way of peace, they know not. Read that part again. The way of peace, they know not. God said the way of peace, you know not. But yet still, y'all get shot down the street by the white man. No, oh, no justice, no peace. Peace. Bring it on. Peace. Y'all talking about peace. peace oh. God said y'all don't know peace. Right. Because destruction is in your path. Right. And we're bringing this up because nobody else is talking about it. Right. The prophets of God is going to come out and talk about this thing. Right. Because we are sent to do this. Right. We are sent before destruction comes to this place. Right. Brother, young brother, young brother, young brother, hey, here 
scripture. God said, our people, the way of peace, they don't know. In Oblak, do they know about peace? Do they know about peace? What's going on in Oblak? It's life lavish. I wake up, uh, the, uh, the birds are tweeting, the kids are playing. Life is lavish in Oblak. I'm sure you I'm sure you bump drill music all the time. Drill music is kill music. That music put, put a spirit of killing upon y'all. And you know exactly what I'm talking about. Are you smiling? You know that there's a murderous spirit here in Chicago, in Oblak. You, you weren't aware of that. Read that verse again. The way of peace. They know not. God sent us to address that wickedness going on in Oblak. You understand? You must understand, bro. You are an Israelite according to the Bible. We're not just niggas that's walking around every single day just doing all kind of foolishness that like we ain't got no purpose. That's not, that's not, that's not what we were put on this earth to do. We were not put on this earth to be caged in a complex like this. We were not put on this earth to sell drugs to each other. Read it again. The way of peace, they know not. We are addressing our brothers and sisters here. God said the way of peace, they know not. Why? Because he want to kill, kill, kill. Drill music. The music itself is just promoting. Yo, kill it, kill it. Let's go right at these niggas. Let's go right at those niggas. Let's go right at these niggas. Let's go right at those niggas. Let's go kill him. Let's go kill him. That's madness. Read on. And there is no judgment in their goings. They have made them crooked paths. They have done what? Made them crooked paths. God said the path you're walking on is crooked. Crooked, bro. So that's what we're already to teach. Repentance. Because guess what? Destruction is coming to this place. Judgment is coming to this place. Do 13 and 3. Hey, this applies to any, all of us. If we do not repent, Jesus the Christ, not, not this dude, not that man. Christ looks more like that. Christ is a black man, according to the Bible. You understand? Christ is not a so-called Caucasian. This man, his name is Caesar Bourget. They, they took, this man is an actual man, you know that, right? He's not Christ. He, go Google him. You see his face. They put his face as Christ. He's an actual man. Everybody loves Google. Go Google it. Google, Google it, and you see him. That is not just a Christ. But the whole world is worshiping, is worshiping this image as Christ. You understand? Read that. Listen up, bro. Listen up. You ain't got nowhere to be right now. You ain't got nowhere to be. Oh, oh, black don't look like this often. Oh, black don't look like this often. So you need to listen, brother. Listen. Judgment is coming. Listen to the voice of God, which is the Bible. Listen. Read. The book of Luke, chapter 13, verse 3. I tell you, nay. Who's speaking? Jesus the Christ, the black Messiah. Christ said, I tell you, no, listen. Listen what I'm going to tell you right now. But except ye repent. Christ said, except you repent. Except I repent. Except the people of Obla repent. Except the people of Chicago repent. Read. Ye shall all likewise perish. God said, you are going to die. We're all going to die if we don't repent. Y'all don't hear that often. We got to put the fear of God with the scriptures on, on, on our brothers. You understand? It's not, it's not my words. It's not our words. This is God's words to teach you right here, bro. Take the flyer. Read the flyer. Learn who you are according to the Bible. Destruction is coming.
Let's go!